Hi there, how are you? Today we talk about traditional Arab men's clothing. Listen to the text. Arab men have worn a traditional set of clothing for hundreds of years. This outfit is comfortable, functional, and very well adapted to the hot, dry climate of the Arabian Peninsula. The centerpiece of the outfit is the dish dasha, a long-sleeved, loose-fitting tunic that is put on over the head. Most dish dashas are made of white, lightweight cotton. The earliest type was a simple rectangular piece of cloth with a hole for the head, but today's dish dasha often has a low collar, buttons at the neck and sleeves, and pockets inside the tunic. The dish dasha is worn with a three-piece headdress. The kafiya, a small round cap, is the piece that goes on first. Then the gutra, a large square piece of white or checkered cloth, is folded into a triangle and laid over the kafiya. Finally, the agao, a double circle of black cord, is placed firmly on top to keep the entire headdress in place. The headdress provides shade from the sun and can be worn to keep blowing sand out of the face. Completing the outfit are long white trousers, leather sandals, and a bisht, an outer garment that is worn over the dish dasha on formal occasions or during cooler weather. Now I read sentences to you and I give three options. You pause the video and answer the question in front of your computer. This is really important, my friend. Pause the video and answer the question. Listen. The dish dasha is similar to a long shirt, to a men's pajamas, or to a jacket. The gutra is in the shape of a rectangle, a circle, or a square. The agao is folded in half. The agao holds the headdress down, or the agao co cover the eyes. The bisht is worn on the feet, in cool weather, or under the dish dasha. Answer the questions, my friend. Visit our website for more curiosities about traditions. Thank you very much. I'm Felipe Givi. See you next class.